on the periodic table as we learn divide into period. And now we focus on group relationship, the group. I also select the first four period to demonstrate. Now let's focus on group. Student, learn one word. The outside shell electron, the outside shell electron is called valency electron, called the valence electron. Means, I show you. On group one, you have one outside electron, one outside electron. So the valence electron is one. Group two, two outside electron. So the valence electron on group two is two. Three valence electron, four valency electron, five valence electron, six valence electron, seven valence electron, eight valence electron. Student, you may ask why we learn this new word valency electron. Outside shell electron. Why? Because all chemical reaction happen on this valency electron. So this valency electron determine the chemical reaction. The valency electron determine the chemical reaction. And the inside shell it does not take part in the reaction. That's why we have to learn this valence electron, outside electron. And also, that is another meaning. Valency electron, if you learn one element within the group, if you learn one element within the group, and they will represent the remaining of the group, they will represent the remaining of the group. And now I show you. Magnesium have two valence electron, group two. Means if you learn magnesium, as long as they are in the same group, they all carry similar chemical property. Means BE will have a similar chemical property as Mg as Ca. So in the other word, you learn one, you learn the rest. You learn one atom of the group, you will learn the rest in the group. Same as you learn oxygen. If you learn oxygen, they are group six. So they will have a similar chemical property of the same group. So you learn oxygen, that means you already learn sulfur and the rest. So you learn one atom well, the remaining you also will know they will be very much similar. So to study periodic table, all you need to do is to know one element in the group, as example, Sodium. You learn the property of sodium. That means you will know the whole group one. Magnesium. You learn the property of magnesium. It represents the whole group two. As you learn the property of chlorine, it represents the whole group of group seven. As you learn sulfur the property of sulfur, and it represents the whole group six. So you just learn one element of each row, and it re represents the remaining of the whole group. So that's the way the importance of valency electron, the valency electron, the outside electron, that it carry all the chemical reaction.